Welcome to the greatest pressure washing channel in the universe. What up guys? Mike here, Owens Pressure Washing Entrepreneur Army. So, been getting a lot of feedback on the roof cleaning time lapse type tip type videos. So, in this one we got shingle and we got tile and a few tips and tricks along the way. So, hope you like it. See if you guys like this the gear we got and then in the back I don't know if you can read that but it's the soft wash and chill t-shirt so anyway guys enjoy the video Nothing beats the uh, Guy Blackman shooter tip. As far as being straight and let not that much mist, you can't beat this bad boy. That's more than two stories, and I gotta get some. I, I treated it, but it's still not coming off, so I gotta hit it with some. It hits it with the, like, still probably 500 psi. And the M5 reaches, but it doesn't give the pressure at that. M5 is good for like the single story, but when you're over two stories, like this peak, and just laying the pressure on there. Not crazy pressure, but enough to get that, you know, after you treat it to get the stains off. But yeah, Guy Blackman shooter tip. It's called the original shooter tip. Check it out on Facebook, you'll see it. Uh, I think that may be it, but. Oh. Am I in one? I felt something on my ear that shouldn't have been on my ear because there's nothing here. Alright. I might have to, yeah, we'll probably have to tarp this up just while I hit that spot. That's such a weird, like, it's a little pocket. And then... So weed sandwich in the roof there. Let's see. Look at it pop popping through there. It is. Alright. Yeah. You. What? What's that? It's alright. Just put it in those rocks. No big deal. Look at this piece. Yeah. <sighs> gutter, gutter tree. Um, what's it called? When you're done doing the edges and the rinsing the bottom of the roof, yeah. rinse the driveway off and the little walkway here. Now everything's starting to come out now. Yeah, but you can rinse just ball valve all this out of the driveway and the walkway.
see that well, but this is called the uh, Acaso 12 inch dash cam, and it's pretty dope, especially if you got workers, which I'm trying to implement not even being in the truck. So, the way it works is you got let's see, you got your front, you got your front camera, and then you got your back camera. You can adjust it like see I got my bucket right there and what it does is it just it records front and back three minute long videos it just keeps recording 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 and then there's files and then so when the SD card fills up with I don't know probably like a month worth of footage it just deletes the oldest one and then if I want something happens I can lock I can hit the lock button and lock front and back that video and it will save so it won't ever delete and then you could pull bring the SD card look at the computer and you know if something happens you can review the footage also if you're in parking mode and your truck or car gets hit it automatically locks that footage as well too um, also it has GPS so if you have a crew you can go back and look and see what they were where they were in, in real time so or find out exactly what time where they were and things like that but yeah you can see the back see Austin's in the back right now messing with his hand washing his hands so thought that was pretty cool the Acaso 12 inch dash cam